Hey y'all, I got a new toy. Ooh, a heat press. And that is my QR code for our channel. I'm getting ready to put some of these on my t-shirt. Okay, here's my t-shirt. And I'm gonna feed it up there because I want it on like, you know, like a, like a tattoo on a stamp type of thing. So I'm gonna put it on, like on the shoulder, like about right here. Smooth all that out. And it goes that way. Okay. Put it right there. This is my test on my shirt. I'm going to um, put the Teflon paper on here. I went and bought all of this stuff. So hopefully this works. Here we go. And count down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oop. That always goes sliding around. That Teflon paper is, I guess it's good stuff. Looks okay. I'm going to slide this around. Ooh, that joint is hot. Ooh, child. It's right there. Now, we'll let it cool off for a little bit, and we'll come back. I'm not sure if it's hot peel or not. Might be hot peel. I don't know. But anyway, it might be crooked too. But that's okay because these are homemade and this is what I do. I trial and error. <clears throat> I guess it's cool enough. So let's see if it can peel off. Uh, Got to get a little piece first. Start it off. Whoa, look at that. I got a QR code on the back of my t-shirt. I had done this part with the Cricut. This is our channel, Everyday Life with Ron and Rose. And now I got a hashtag on the back, on my shoulder. Ah, that's cute. Oh, uh, really cool. All right, I'm going to do Ron's shirt too. <laughs> okay, now for Ron's shirt. I'm going to put his like right there in the back of his neck type thing. Closer to the neckline, but in the middle. Because I'm strange like that. So I'm fitting the shirt on here. And let's see, that looks about right, right there. And here's my QR code. Gonna put it right there. Here's the label, so I'm gonna put it in the middle there. And put my Teflon paper on here. I don't know if I have to use this stuff every time, but anyway. I saw somebody did it, so. And because I didn't like my little heat press I got from for my Cricut, I bought this one. And it's an Amazon purchase. All right, let's go. Lock it in and count down. I'm just counting down 10 seconds, seven. Six, five, four, three, two, one. There goes the paper again. Move that out the way. Whew. 
That is really hot. I guess I ought to do uh, something for his birthday. But I did make a sign for the door. And here we go. How you like that one? That's a big old QR code. And our channel name. And watch us on YouTube. A little red thing right there. I'm just going to put it in a little slider, plastic slider, and tape it to the door. Along with his big birthday card that... I want everybody to sign and feel happy just like he is. Okay, I guess it's cool enough. I'm going to take it off. Got these things on here. I'm not sure. I guess I need them. Woo, let it cool off a little bit. Still kind of warm. And like I said, I'm not sure if this is you know like heat peel or not well all right let's look at that a little more closely see there it is I'm feeling kind of good about myself yay so I picked up these graphics. I ordered them from a lady in uh, Texas and I'm going to try to put one on a t-shirt I got from Sam's Club. Uh, let's move my water out the way. I need a big old workstation. Hope I ain't burn up my shirt. Let's see. It's hot peel, so at least that's what she says. Whoa. Okay, I got this t shirt from Sam's. Anyways, this is the shirt. Still has a tag on it. And I'll show you what it says. Sun, salt, and sand. Huh. There's nothing on the back of it, so I'm just going to seal it in a little bit more. This time I'm not gonna thread it through. Just go put it on here, just to seal it a little bit more. I am going to have a blast because I bought a bunch of different things from her when she had clearance sales and stuff. And there's still a little piece on here that didn't go so well so I'm gonna try I'm gonna try to put it on here and I'll hit it again see if it's catches those two piece those little bit of pieces all right let's go huh. boy this thing gets hot I mean, it's real hot. Wow. 
Well, that didn't catch, so. Let me move it up. Maybe it was too. Ah, shoot, that hot on the end, so I'm gonna try it again. It said you don't need a cover for it, so let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. If it don't catch this time, I ain't gonna worry about it because it says what it says and I love it. So. Uh, I'm gonna let it cool a little bit. That time, I believe it worked. because it doesn't have to be perfect because it's mine and I'm gonna wear it anyway. Okay. And I believe it's sealed in there pretty good. What do you think guys? Sun, salt, and sand. Just right for the cruise, huh? I'm feeling good. Oh, glare. I'm in the closet. Well, that's where I do all my stuff. My closet is my office. Ha! <laughs> and that's the room in there. But here's my heat press, my tower for my purses. And I'm going to do those are our clothes we're getting ready put in the suitcase. I'm going to try that suitcase move too. Anywho, this is our closet room and it's a little junky right now because I'm still trying to work on my organization. But I bought my t-shirt graphics from the T Academy. I found them on Instagram. And um, let's see, it's the T Academy 21777 Merchants Way, Caddy, Texas. And um, they sell t shirt graphics. And all you need is a heat press. So, I have like an abundance because when she had her sale, I was like buying them and with a plan, not necessarily really about the selling thing, but I like to gift and um, that's what's going to happen. I made, uh, got a bunch of graphics for my girlfriends, my girlfriends and Anyway, that's cool because it's crappy outside today. No sunshine. It's very, very rainy. Ugh. Anywho, let's do some more stuff. <laughs> 